Hey, it's Vince with Article Marketing Robot. I'm just doing a quick little video on what you can expect with the Web20 and Wiki platform add-on upgrade. Um, so right now, I just pretty much completed a submission to the uh, Web20 Wiki platforms. As you can see, I've got the Article Directory platforms turned off. And I got 920 submitted uh, articles to various Wiki and Web 2.0 sites, and all of them have a live link associated with them because the live links are extracted on submit. Um, you can verify this by clicking the links, and you'll see that the article actually does show up. And there are some higher PR stuff in here. Some of you are concerned about, well, they're all PR zero junk, but that's not the case for all these sites. Um, some of them will 404 out, uh, like you know, articles, some of these sites are actually moderated, so the, these articles may get taken down from time to time, but that's okay, because you got 920. Now, the uh, initial site list I, I provide for Web20 and Wiki is about 600 sites, and I managed to just scrape around um, and search SEO forums to find a whole bunch more sites. In, in fact, I have more like um, 3,200 sites in the site list, and there's a lot of lot of sites that haven't signed up properly. A lot of that is due to uh, language issues. Um, like for example, these are Russian domains, so the success uh, text in the back end. Right now, AMR looks for uh, English text uh, when you when you get a successful sign up or a successful submission. So that's uh, one of its failing points right there. That's why you're getting these unknowns. But as I actively develop this software, I'm going through all these uh, foreign language websites and finding what the success text is and incorporating it in. And that's all done on the web server side. So uh, you wouldn't actually need to update your software anyways. Um, you just have to restart it from time to time and your sex success rates should go up as I incorporate more language um, options. So anyways, yeah, I just wanted to show you this video of the submitted on the Web20 Wiki stuff. And it's pr very, very promising, actually. There's there's just a lot of potential here. A lot more live links and submitted articles coming out of uh, Web20 and Wiki than there was, or than there currently is in the article directory side. And that's a bonus. So if you, if you think about it, 67 bucks isn't that much of an upgrade considering that there are softwares that specialize in wiki and web 20 or just wiki and that either cost that much or more so it's really I would consider it a good deal and for the amount of work that I'm going to be putting into this uh, you can expect a lot of upgrades in the future so that's kind of what I wanted to show you and uh, Ranko Jones this one's for you so uh, thanks a lot thanks for watching the video bye